Hi, Jackie. I'm Leslie Burkus. It's nice to meet you. Well, Jackie, I work at an organization called Trees Forever. I do love trees. They provide so many benefits for us. Most people just see a tree, but they don't think of all the things they provide for us all year long. Uh, they shade our houses in the summertime and keep us cool. In the winter, they stop the winter winds from blowing through our house. They soak up storm water. They give us food. There's so many different things they provide for us. Well, trees act like a sponge and they soak up water. And there's actually three different ways that trees help water quality. They intercept rain when it falls from the sky and it holds the rain on its leaf surface and then the water evaporates into the air. It infiltrates into the ground, so the water goes into the ground and the tree roots suck up that water into its tree structure. And then the tree takes up that water through its leaves and it transpires the water into the air. These different things that come from trees. I've got some nuts here. There's the hazelnut and a walnut here. Do you like nuts? I bet you would. And what about this apple? We get pears and apples and bananas and oranges, all sorts of things that feed us. And do you know what this is? This used to have maple syrup in it. And did you know that it takes 30 to 40 gallons of sap to make one gallon of maple syrup? That's a lot of sap from a sugar maple tree. And this isn't for dogs. Chocolate's not good for dogs, but I love chocolate. And chocolate only comes from trees in the world. So what would happen if we lost our trees? We wouldn't have any chocolate to eat anymore. We actually live in the urban forest, Jackie. All those trees around your house, along the streets and the parks where you play, in this urban woodland here, they're part of a forest. They're just in an urban area. So we call it the urban forest. Well, thanks, Jackie. I'm glad you could come talk to me. Yeah. I will take you for a walk in the urban forest.